the uh, afternoon of day six of 11 day hunt. And this is our third day back to this particular ridge. We've been watching this ridge now for uh, a few days. And there are two bulls in here. One is Lamarcus, who's in the low 50s. And one that we've named Reggie, who is in the low 60s. Obviously we'd like to see Reggie but we haven't seen him yet this morning. So Marcus had just exposed himself here just a few minutes ago. And he's got a cow with him that we saw him bed down with last night. Well, just here in the last 15, 20 minutes, he's pushed off two smaller bulls. So we think the running activity is just starting to get heated up. And if we don't see Reggie by two or three o'clock this afternoon, we're actually gonna go put a stock on the Marcus because of the challenging state that he's in and the defensive state of the rut that we think that'll give us a better better opportunity to get within PSC range to uh, maybe close the, close the deal. So if you need patience, you need more patience to hunt moose than I've ever thought because it's glass, glass, glass. So hopefully this afternoon we might be in the chips with the rut starting to fire up here.
Well, it's the morning of day eight. It's uh, about 10.30 or so. And the fog has finally lifted to the point that uh, our glassing is getting a little bit more efficient. And we were pleasantly surprised. We just now spotted Reggie, which is the larger of the two bulls that we've been chasing for seven days now at this same ridge. So we lost him yesterday, never put our eyeballs on him all day long after 12, 13 hours of glassing. So we just now spotted him. So he will be our bull of choice today to uh, chase him down somehow, some way.